so excited. Wanna ski excited? Wanna ski anxiety? I'm kind of sad and excited at the same time. Like this is the last time I'm driving this car. I have to move on to bigger and better things. So I'm ready for. Oh, yay! What? <laughs> Hi, Dr. Squad. How are you? It's a very big day for our squad. <laughs> so first of all, I'm with Frida in the car and I'm going to drive up. Yay! <laughs> the last day I'll have this car because I'm buying a new car. Yay! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this has been, let's say, like a month in the works. I'll tell you guys the whole story of how and why I decided to buy a new car. But in the meantime, let's go inside the car yard where i'm buying the car it's the same place where i bought this car however at that time they didn't have their own car yard but wame grow so says they have their own car yard so yes we're on kiambu road and i'm so excited i just want to see the car at least make sure all things are in order and then i'll probably come back tomorrow and pick it up so yeah let's go <laughs> Oh, hi, 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 I'm really excited. I can't wait for also for you guys to see which car I got. Like, can you guys guess in the comments what you guys, which car do you guys think I got? So, anyways, uh, we're about to go outside. You got ready? No, that's the expensive. Mingi. What's the range? Uh, from 2.7 to 3.5. 2.7 yeah. to 3.7. Yeah. Which year? 20... 2016 around 2.6, 2.7. Okay. 2017 is from 3.3. Uh, so okay. Fully loaded, we talk about 3.7, 2.3. Okay. Yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> It's a pretty color. Mm, it's very, very pretty. I love it so much. So, if you guys remember in my QA, I had mentioned that burgundy is my favorite color. Here we are. I'm not sure if this is burgundy though. I think this is just wine red. Yeah, wine red. Yeah. Okay, so our wine red is not my favorite color. We <laughs> <laughs> have the keys. Thank you. No way. Uh, okay. Maybe this is the last like two days. Mm. I mean, <laughs> nice. I've been through the excitement. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I can't wait to just to see just drive it, see mm. it, you know, mm. all that. I'm so excited. Of course, right now, the next course of action would be bring Mogambi. You guys have seen seen him in my previous vlog. He's my mech, Akuja Angalie Gari. Once he approves, says the car is good, gives me the go-ahead, we pay and we move. Yeah. yeah. So hopefully, I want to be done with that today. So Mogambi's on his way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think we need to be on record up and an ice cream. Yes. So we need to make it tomorrow <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, you guys, you have no idea. Like, honestly, it's a long time coming. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Exercise in new big things. <laughs> I think I'll show you guys the interior properly tomorrow. Mm -hmm. 
because they need to clean it kuna a few things they need to do again imetoka kwenye tu imekuja tu kutoka kwa pot they only clean the outside because i told them that i would be vlogging so anyways yeah that's my new ride mm. that's my new ride mm. i'm so happy <laughs> you guys have no idea mm. actually most of you might be excitement here to see the akito then now you get to drive it god god has been faithful <laughs> only god only god <laughs> I like your to your detail here. Yeah. Your, your logo. logo mm. yeah. Glass. I love that. Mm. This this CD, my mom got it for me when I got the first car. In it was Jesus ni number moja. I have never opened it or used it. He me andi safari ndani. I hope it's the one. I never got to use it on my other car, so I want to bless this car with this one. Hey. Who is Unfortunately because of copyright they were done here so eventually I'm in the middle of the road test I'm in Mogambi na jamjai mwana I don't record him but yes he's my mic The following day Good morning just came from the shower i haven't even combed my hair i just directly started getting ready because i'm going to pick my car up today so i'm going to start by moisturizing my face with a perfect and radiant um moisturizer mattifying day cream i'm going to be doing a slight bit just because i'm going to be taking a couple of pictures and i want to look the part you know oh by the way i'm going to be looking down at my mirror right here I hope it's not in frame because I can't see I don't have my Apple Watch on so I'm not able to verify if it's in frame or not. I actually need to buy a new Apple Watch. I need to get my got to be glue gel so that I can slick down my edges as I do the rest of my face. So let me get that. It's a very exciting day for me for obvious reasons. Where do I start? Should I start why I decided to get another 65? If you're familiar with my channel then you may know that i usually say often that i got employed in 2016 when i first got employed of course first order of business i knew for sure i wanted to do my masters and i also knew that i wanted to buy a new car so i needed to plan what i did i told myself that if i start saving now and planning accordingly then it means i can get my first car in 2018 and then i can also commence my master, my masters the same year So I knew I'm going to start off with a small car. I knew for sure I wanted to get a um, Swift. I was obsessed with the Swift. I can't even know how to get it. Like, wow, this car is so cute. I mean, I still think so. So what happened is, uh, eventually, when I was able to save up the money, I had six hundred and twenty thousand. I told my dad, okay, I have six hundred and twenty thousand. Of course, my dad, given that he's been selling spares um, for the last, I think maybe thirty years. So he was like, okay, sawa. When I was buying that car, I didn't even have I hadn't done my proper research to know that when you're budgeting for a car, you need to budget for things like insurance, fueling the car cuz most of them, if not all, come empty and you need to fuel. I hadn't thought of the fact that I need to pay for service for the car, things like that. For me when I got the 620 That's all I had. My dad was like, no problem, I'll go get it for you from Mombasa. So I specifically told my dad Nataka Suzuki Swift. My dad goes to to Mombasa and then he tells me that yenye naona huko tupeke yake ni vits. And I knew my dad was doing that very intentionally because before he left he was trying to convince me to get a Toyota. You guys know like our folks they are obsessed with Toyota. And I understand because Toyota was a brand built for durability, efficiency, you know all that i wanted to to pull up in a cute car i didn't care about efficiency sijui resale value nini nini all those things i did but of course my dad was taking all that into account when he was leaving my person he told me he's got an avit i was disappointed but at the same time because it's my first car and i trust my dad i was like i don't care i really don't care i just want the car to get here and you know i also felt like it was important because i was just starting school so i would need a car to move around from home to school to work and all that eventually when he came back to nairobi ali kuja na na vids i'll find a picture put it on the screen you know finally naza chana na matatu ma uba ma lift nini 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 i can just now focus on you know like cruising in my tiny car he brought the car to the office oh my god i need to i need to do my makeup as i talk i was so excited and then my dad was just like listen now um i need to go with this car because i need to put for you tint 
uh, sound system, all that. You know, maybe, again, maybe you know this, these things. So my dad shows love. He's not the type of man to tell you, oh, I'm proud of you. Sijui, nini. He's a very typical, traditional Meru man, you know? Like now, the words of affirmation that my my mom told me, there's like a vlog I did and, and everyone was just talking about the way my mom speaks to me. She speaks so much life, so much love into me. He shows up with his actions. And I find that typically, even in the way I date, I would rather you show up in your actions than your words. So my dad, he, he you know, I, I would have preferred if he told me he was proud of me at that time. But he took the car. He went and did, he put tint on it. He put sound system. He put the covers on the seats and then he also did service he insured the car for me all that to me i feel like yes he may not have said i'm proud of you but him doing those things was just a way to show me that he was proud so grateful for my daddy and he's so grateful i had the vids for five years that was the best car i could have started my my journey off with the car was very unproblematic fast forward to 2021 20, i'm just about to finish my my phd i'm like okay i have a little disposable income um what do i do i need to upgrade my car because when i had the vits i realized i love going for drives and of course the vits would limit me to going a lot of places because again it's a small car when i asked my dad like okay which car would you recommend my dad was like miss 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 tubishi miss tubishi hope i'm pronouncing that right i thought why not get an R rvr i liked the shape i didn't mind it after a while I also noticed this other one called ASX, which I later found out that it's literally the same car. It's just that one is from Japan and the other one is from Spain. Correct me if I'm wrong. But I was like, I'm going to get this RVR. I want this RVR. Once I set my mind on something, that is all you're going to hear about if you're in my life. Sawa. I literally had even my own sister running up and down trying to figure out ERVR to a wapi to a wapi, you know. <laughs> I was just having a conversation with Barra and I was telling him how I want to upgrade my car. And then he asked me, what are you looking at? And I told him, a rear. And then he said, oh, that's a nice car. Have you thought about CX-5? I literally said, what's that? Not which car is that? As in, I, I had never heard of CX-5. I had never seen it anywhere up until this point. This is 2021 because I bought the car in 2022, but I started looking towards the end of 2021. It's like, if we just Google it, Google that, and then also Google something called Atenza. I go Google, what is this X5? Now, when I Google, the first site that came up was Gigi, like people selling that car on Gigi. I'm like, which car is this? Hey, from that moment onwards, from the moment I saw CX5, I was obsessed. Now, one thing we're going to give to Mazda, is the shape of their cars i don't think anyone is doing it the way mazda is even for the reason that mazda was kind of like a brand that was dead ish somehow for a couple of years and now all of a sudden they just came back the shape of their cars that's what got me i'm not going to sit here and lie to you and tell you at all and it was the performance of the cars Jeannie, Nini. me those things i came to find out about them later but when i was shopping for the car i just looked at the cosmetic bit of it and i was like this car is beautiful uh, some of them come with a sunroof. I'm sold. That's it. Take my money. <sighs> Sorry, I had to change angles because there's a blackout at my place. Aww. So I can't use the lighting and all that stuff. And I'm running late, so I need to finish this. I want to shorten this story because I feel like ni may refusha sana for no apparent reason. So anyway, I reached out to my friend Ellie. At that time, Ellie used to sell cars and I knew that even if he didn't have that car in stock, because for him, he was mostly dealing with Prados, then at least he could point me in the right direction in terms of who I can buy. I can buy the car from. So I'll never forget this. By the way, I get this life is so interesting. Like you just meet people look on ground and next thing they're just like making such a big impact in your life because he really went out of his way to make sure that I was comfortable. At that time also, like when I say comfortable, like trying to explain to me, you see the raw diesel, because you know in Kenya we usually have this mentality towards diesel cars, particularly because my dad is such an alarmist when it comes to diesel cars and I don't blame him, you know. Kitambo Magariza diesel zilikuwa zinasumbwa sana. 
also something else that bothers people with these cars for diesel is like the keep taking it to get serviced often so that's something else that uh, was also concerning me like will i be able to afford your cushion and even maintain every few kilometers i have to take it for service but he really tried to explain to me he was like listen the difference will be so little you won't even notice i really really wanted a sunroof i was like that is the one thing that i'm not willing to negotiate on and the only way i can get a sunroof is if i get a diesel car so i was like okay fine let's get this diesel car so the first generation of the cx5 is 2012 what used to happen was the the car comes with a junction pipe that is plastic now uh over time this plastic junction pipe wears off so you need to change it from uh plastic to either brass aluminium or copper and most people used to assume that the cx5 had an engine issue when really it was a junction pipe issue so once you change that you're good because me i've had my cx5 for two good years never had any mechanical issues with it as well and believe me when i tell you it's not like i wasn't scared even when i was buying i was scared i was like guy hey, aki my dad will be so disappointed and let me tell you in fact when i took that car home to meru of course my dad was happy to see, to see the car blah 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 then the first question he asked me was igari ni diesel i was like yeah he didn't even scold me the way i thought that he would just go off he'd be mad and he didn't even care he was just like umefanya kitu mzuri Hey, congratulations if did he say congratulations those are not words that leave my dad's mouth i'm lying but i think he was just he just said this is good it, it seemed like a nice car and same same he went out of his way he made sure that the insurance of the car was paid he serviced the car. he just made sure that the car was in order for me personally i've not had any issues and that's why you see i'm going from a cx5 to a cx5 when i get to the car yard i'm going to take you guys through and show you like the different specs of the two cars in comparison with each other it's not like i'm trying to take this uh, channel into the direction of of cars but i do feel like it's necessary for someone who maybe may want to upgrade or is considering maybe getting a cx5 take it from me as a cx5 babe you will not regret this so i want to finish doing my beat So at least I'm done. Mama Maliza kunini. Nimesikia Frida akiingia. Frida. Hey. Hi. Sasa. Oh. Yes, nimekuletea. Mendeta. Very mean and dingy. I can't believe I'm so angry. Shout out to people who know you. I can thank you. What? Vile nasikia nja. Today you have saved the day. So let me wear my lashes and then again I'll see you guys at the at the kayad. Dactari squad, good morning once again. I already finished my beats. We're on our way to the kayak. I'm so sorry if my phone is shaking. I can't stand. It's just very unstable. Anyways, ah, I'm so excited. Wanna get excited? Wanna get anxiety? Yeah. So basically, the plan is to just go pick the car and then go for lunch. There's this canoe spot on Mombasa Road called Agile. Actually, let me not use car because it's a whole, it's a whole. Grand Hotel. Mm. Uh, yeah, so we're going to go for lunch there. Nothing major. So I'm kind of sad and excited at the same time. Like this is the last time I'm driving this car. It's kind of bittersweet. I mean, the car has been so good to me. This was my first. Uh, I don't want to say big car, but as in like Garyanye Kauchini. Yeah, I'll pick it. Matrix Kobam. So yeah, I'm excited and I'm sad at the same time. But I mean, we have to move on to bigger and better things. Yeah, so I don't know why. Yani na feel like I'm talking to someone, but as I said, this car has a name, Medusa. So yeah, she's been good to me, honestly. But nice time to move on. You guys saw the other car. I'm so in love with the color. Size because it's heading to to noon. We had reservation at the at the other side for to one thirty. So yeah, I want to be able to just pick the car and bounce. I was the last person to drive me. Uh, yes, you were the last. <laughs> yeah, she really was. Uh, the other person, the last person other than me. Yes, uh, other than the owner. Other than the owner, yes. Uh, but yeah, actually, I had even posted it on my story. What were you using? Yes, sana, sana, sana. So I'm ready for. Oh, oh yay! Yay! what? <laughs> 
Oh my guy, this is so sweet. I wish Kakamero recorded I think in like what? Ah, uh, yeah, Dark Squad. Dactari Squad. It looks so nice. This store's not full of them. Apa baby, you should have a last month when they shoot. Should I be here home? Me too. Go. I love to do the shoot. Eh, eh. At where's he was? He's on balloons. Yeah, yes, yes, and I go. I'm so happy. Where did you get it? Come see your new ride. <laughs> you like? I love. You love me. I love. I'm so thankful. As I said, I bought even the the previous car, Harper. Uh, but at that time, they weren't. They didn't have this yard. So yes, now I'm just I'm just happy. Like I'm just happy to be back. I'm just happy for what they did. I'm so grateful. I'm just excited about this whole thing. Like I feel so good. I feel so happy. Yani, I can't believe it. I'm just. Hmm. I know it's not a big deal, it's not like Nimen Unwajiwagon or anything, but Tanazuba. <laughs> I'm just so happy. Oh my god, you guys, like I am so happy. I'm so elated. Like this is so cute and so thoughtful of them. So because the interior of the car is uh ivory, I had carried um a genio outfit that will go better with this with this car. Like in Yetaka Poniki Nikipos Kaigaru. So I want to go change as they as they move the car because you want to move the car and belly and your if it's limited you on a can but yo 20 minutes later oh so, uh at least you may change now feel come a wallet super cool i wanted to wear this because it looks exactly like the seats i don't know about this color this color of the outfit in a kanana so i felt it a car poor like like if you get your picture hey. Photoshoot. Roger, roger. Roger. a photo shoot and I've requested the lady Carol, um, she works here with Stage, to give us just a comparison of the two, the 2017 vis a vis the 2014, so that you guys can know what to expect if you get either or anything in between. So, Hi. That. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Mm -hmm. My name is Carol, I work at Fate Limited. Mm -hmm. So, we start first, the, we start with the exterior features. Uh, as you can look, one of the things you'll note with the 2017, that's the second generation model, mm -hmm. they made it more sleek from the shape itself, oh, sorry, the yeah. bonnet, the grill, yeah. even the headlights yeah. and the rear lights yeah. and even the um, 
fog lights yeah. that made them very scary. Oh, yeah, I guess. Yeah. 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 But I'm going to tell you, those, those lights can see far. Mm-hmm. You can see very far. Small, small but mighty. Yeah. Small but mighty. <laughs> they are small mm-hmm. but mighty. Yeah. So, and one of the other additional features exteriorly they added mm-hmm. is in the side mirrors. Mm-hmm. They have winkers mm-hmm. that do... Uh, oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Uh-huh. And like the one that will close, uh, yes, there's one more generation the, of the side. Yeah. yeah. So, this one's do the whole one. 80, mm-hmm. and then they, yeah, it's, it's the head that will wash up. Oh, for this generation. Uh, Otherwise, mm-hmm. both of them are diesel. 2020, the uh, aging capacity has not changed. Mm-hmm. But what has changed is the fuel consumption. Mm-hmm. They have made the second generation more fuel friendly. Uh-huh. So one of the things uh, the second generation did different from the first generation. Uh-huh. Most of the sensors in the first generation were centered uh, along the windscreen at, at the center top. Uh-huh. But what the second generation have done... They have split the sensors. So this is the radar. Uh-huh. In this radar is a smart city braking system, adaptive cruise control. Uh-huh. So these ones are located here. They've put them here. The windscreen still retains the rain sensor and the road sign assistant. Uh-huh. So a traffic signs as pedestrian crossing suddenly will be recognized by the sensor still in the windscreen. So other than that, we can go inside. Mm. Then we can now see the interior. interior and the additional safety. So this, uh, the first generation, mm. yes, it, uh, it didn't have power. It's the very first one. But with this second generation, they introduced not only the powered seats, but also on the driver's side, it has a two-stage setting system. One of the things that the twenty, the second generation has done for the infotainment system, it has a single tablet freestanding system that is more interactive vis-a-vis the older version, which was a screen uh, within the dashboard itself. AC system, both of them, yes, had dual control, but what this has added is additional vents at the back. Yes, yeah, yeah. you're you <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. mm. at the back, so yeah. at least the, the the climate is more or less the same. Now, is it feeling cold? Mm. Cold, the steering is cold. You can heat it up. You can heat it up. Mm. Come here, this is um, the traction uh, system. Mm-hmm. You can turn it off mm. the, until the emergency. Oh, uh-huh. if it bothers you, you can actually turn it off mm. by pressing the mm. you can turn it off. And then these are the blind spots. Yeah? Mm. As you can see, what I was telling you about, it protects your surrounding for safety. Mm. So you click here. These are the parking sensors. They are too much. Mm. Uh, there are people, but at the end of the day, the, the whole reason for safety features is that for your own safety. Mm. But these are just gives you the option of turning it off if you want, mm. including the lane assist. And then um, this is the eye stop. You notice when you're idling in traffic, yes, it turns off. It will just consult you. It will consult you at the end of the day. Mm. Um, the handbrake, they have done this sleek mm. one step handbrake, mm. but again, mm. sometimes you can be in a hurry, mm. so you enter the car, mm. you put it on drive, mm. you close your doors. Once you engage your safety belt, the handbrake will automatically And this is to open your boot. Close the booth now. Sensors, the, uh-huh. heat, the heating sensors for the back seat uh, uh-huh. is the charging point. Uh-huh. Remember, all uh, the first generation and most cars, the charging points are usually central yeah. at the front. Yeah. But this one now allows the people at the back uh-huh. to also can they can able to charge their phones or use their laptops or whatever they need to transfer. It has a USB charging point. And uh, that is a summary of the second generation CX5. Yay! Thank you for choosing Mazda Limited and Mazda. Yeah. Always, 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 always. Mazda has done very well for themselves. Yeah. In all categories of vehicles, by the way, mm-hmm. beginning from the smallest to this one, mm. and it is a, a ride that is worth mm. your money. Money. It yeah. Worth your money, and it will serve you mm-hmm. very, very well. Mm-hmm. You will okay, love it. Thank you. If you love to cruise, mm-hmm. come for the diesel. That I do. That I do. <laughs> so you've heard from the. Horse's mouth or Carol's mouth in <laughs> in better terms. Um, I don't know. I think this is better lighting. Yes. But yeah, I'm elated. I'm happy. I'm hungry. And your champagne it has gone straight to my head because I only had ginger nuts and ribena in the morning. But yeah, I want to go get something to eat.
let me just go at least finish the paperwork with George and then now we can be on our way with a new ride. It's before I go to George, <laughs> before I go sign, I've been told I need to move my thing. It's a beautiful car. Thank you. You see even the way the small chrome just breaks the momentum. Yes. Yes. I would agree. I think it looks really nice. Sana. Thank you. That's my ride. So, anyway, I need to move things from Medusa to Savannah. So, yeah, we're about to do that right now. <laughs> Na <laughs> 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 no singing, no Where are you located? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Uh, we are located at um, the bypass as you come with Kimbulu, just before the bypass, get the left turn. I think some 50 meters from Kimbulu. You find us, Fate Limited Show. We're here to serve you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Alternatively, you can just put on Google Maps, Fate Limited. That's what I used. Because when you're in Nambia bypass, I didn't know what he meant. So, yeah. From wherever you're coming from, just put fit limited it up later directly to the car. It's not very far from that junction for the overpass and the camel mm -hmm. and yes, exactly. Yeah, ju ah, naskia, same too, but on a skia and jalo singing. <laughs> <laughs> but at least now um mini on our savanna when you're naskia and jalo singing. Mm. Okay, Listen, I have been a horrible, horrible, horrible vlogger today. Ignore the savannas in the back. <laughs> so I just left the, the kayak where I got the car. This is the car. Of course, you guys have seen the interior, the exterior, whatever. We had so much going on because I needed to tie a few loose ends before we left. Sorry, I just received a call. Anyway, I'm just getting to Agal right now. I'm waiting for Frida to get here. So I just ordered for Savannah. Remember earlier I mentioned that since we make the balloon, na bow, na flowers, I might as well just do a shoot. Champagne, I make a So 
I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Oh, I'm a fika, finally. Hey. I was thinking Gary alikuwa na suggest to shoot si kud wakati to light tumewashwa za hapa nje. So I was thinking to fanya to wire the place for the shade rooms because uh, I also want to see the rooms I haven't seen them. Uh, so yeah, I just want to, there's a, there's a lady called Mary, I found at the reception, she's part of the Atari squad. Shout out to Mary by the, oh and Damaris, before I forget, and Christine uh, from Absa. That's a whole different story, but I ran into her the other day. So uh, yes, I, I want to do the tour, so we'll do that and then we'll shoot Gioni. Yeah, so let's get cracking. At least Savannah come and Savannah. Savannah. <laughs> you drink Savannah? Yes, I do. <laughs> Yeah, hey, Mefika. So, yes, she will be taking us. Do you want to be the vlog? Do you mind? No? Okay. Nisa, <laughs> Akuna Shida. So, yeah, she's about to take us for the tour. So, I'll show you guys the vibes. As Utenda Nasisema, you'll get the things. Okay, so, watch any come. I'm just about to change into just a long dress a simple dress and then um 
we head out i go out and shoot like it's been such a long day i know it doesn't seem that way but it's been a very long very 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 long day so yeah basically that's the plan for now yeah okay so let me do that I have changed um, nothing too major. I just want the car to be brought because we also don't want to cause traffic. Quickly, quickly, and if I knew your shoot and we move on. This is my baby. <laughs> Let me tell you guys, this is a disaster. I just thank God that I actually got decent photos in China because that was a complete backfire. First of all, we were trying to pick, take pictures up on the Magaris in Apita. For some reason, we just ended up causing traffic. Not for some reason. I I don't know. <laughs> I didn't think it was going to be as busy in the evening as it was because during the day in Dion Kumeja. But regardless, at least I got good content during the day, so it's okay. I'll just try and, and at least get a good photo of this outfit. I don't want to waste it since I'm here. Might as well. So we're about to have dinner. And then, yeah, just call it a day. Uh, at least to see end the evil. Look at this place at night. How beautiful is that? We just left dinner. We are on our way out. And then I figured let me just finish the vlog right here. So we attempted to do the shoot as I mentioned earlier. It backfired on us, but that's okay because we got plenty, plenty, plenty of pictures during the day. I think at a god to like <laughs> stop being greedy. <laughs> that's it for today. I know it's a short vlog, straight to the point. Um, I'm elated, I'm happy again. Thank you so much to Phage Limited and also Agile for just hosting us for being so graceful. I literally called her last minute and I'm like, hey, can I come get a few pictures there? And you know, Mary organized the whole thing, so I'm so grateful. Of course, for Phage Limited for taking me through the whole process of importing the car, getting it here and all that. I am so, so, so grateful and thankful for that. So yeah, anyways, other than that, I am off. I need to go home. I need to rest. I'm tired. Tired. When I tell you my brain is fried, I'm not kidding. I will see you guys on the next vlog and happy Valentine's um, or Galentine's. And even if you spent it alone, that's okay as well there's nothing wrong with that i mean valentine's is just a day like any other day so it's not a big deal <laughs> bye